So we just got finished and she said she's very proud of herself. I'm very proud. Was my, budget, my budget was $25 and what was it 26 and total came to 26.64. So I only went over by dollar and 64 cents. So I would say it was a good thrifting day. It's a good thrifting day. Got some good finds too. Xavier didn't get anything. He, he thought he was too good for all of those. Oh, I didn't mention it was 50% off. He thought he was too good to get the, all the 50% off discounts on his stuff. I don't want to go on expensive Amazon. <laughs> Why am I always the victim of your tax? <laughs> because you're my husband. What's goody perps? So I'm just getting off of work. And my phone is dead. <laughs> Let me know if you guys have this problem too. If you have a YouTube problem such as I. But do you watch and listen to YouTube so much that you forgot you had a radio? So since my camera is dead, no, my camera is not dead. My phone is dead. Since my phone is dead and I have nothing else to do, I was like, huh, what can I do in this car ride right now? while my phone is charging. I was like, oh wait, I have a radio. How do I turn this on? <laughs> what are people listening to these days? What songs are out there? What are my local radio stations? <laughs> Those are all real questions that just went through my head when I got off of work. Does anybody else have that problem? You're so involved and so stuck on YouTube and that's all you do with your life that you forgot that there's other things outside of there including music and a radio like you do not know how to use own radio? Like I, I turn on the system so I could put it on Bluetooth so I could listen to my YouTube videos but this whole radio, this whole radio business, I don't know. But anywho, guys, I am on my way. Ugh. My teeth. I was eating a mango the other day and I guess I flossed too hard, way too hard, because you know how those things, those mangoes get stuck in your teeth and now my gums are all flared up. Ugh. But yes, um, what was I saying? Oh, I'm on my way to the post office and I don't go to the post office much, so you know it is important. But I am opening a P.O. box. I'm opening a P.O. box. I know that's like not a big deal to most people and it really isn't a big deal. But the reason behind why it's a big deal is because of this business that I'm starting. I am starting with my best friends and we need a P.O. box. I was going to wait till Saturday to get it done, but today, Thursday, um, when I'm filming this, it's getting it's getting done. Cause I, I don't wanna put it off till Saturday cause I wanna focus on doing other things that day. And I think they close at seven and it's five o'clock now and it's not like I have anything else to do. So I was like, let me just drive over there and get that knocked out right away. Like I already signed up for it on the website, but I have to like go in and get them paperwork and also I guess pick up the key. I think that's how it works. I, 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 didn't, I don't know anything about getting a P.O. box, so. This is a whole learning experience. I'm back home now. The people at the post office were so nice. I didn't even know it was possible to have like nice working employees at the post office. They were so nice. But, um, I'm home now. <laughs> I, did I say that? I'm pretty sure I did. And if I didn't tell you, maybe the background gave it away. I'm home and I just said it a third time. What the heck, Tiffany? I'm cooking. So remember that Mediterranean diet I told you guys about? I've been going strong for
five days now since Sunday. I've been going strong and it's working pretty well. I can already feel my body feeling different. And although losing weight is not the main goal of this diet or this lifestyle change, I have already dropped two pounds with no exercise. I have not done any exercise, so I'm sure if I did exercise, I'd lose more. Usually I do lose more. That was a problem with me. as like I gain weight too fast and I lose weight too fast. But two pounds, if I could just have two pounds off for in one week, it'll be fine. But healthy living, healthy living. Mediterranean diet, if you don't know, it basically restricts you, and that's what it is, <laughs> um, of sugar, dairy, and like red meat. Really the main focus is to eliminate sugar. That's really what my main focus is. Not like the sugar sugar, but like the hidden sugars because I love bread and stuff like that. Um, and processed food. Everything is, um, I'm eating is like whole, like whole wheat, they're fresh. Those are the types of stuff I'm having. Fruits, vegetables, and like unprocessed food. I think the bread and the frozen processed food is what I've been putting in my body that's not good for me and that's what I'm trying to eliminate that's the whole reason for doing this whole Mediterranean thing I'm trying to do it for I wanted to do it for two weeks but they're saying online to really really see like results you should give it a try at three weeks so I don't know I might push it to three weeks but we'll see so now I'm making some scrambled eggs because I can't get enough eggs <laughs> and I can have as much as much eggs as I'd like Pretty much on any diet, if you think about it, eggs is that food. I am not mad. After watching a ton of drifting videos for inspiration, apparently the men's section is where all the action is. So I'm gonna start there today. I just checked this whole store for men's jeans and apparently the whole section is right here. That's it. <laughs> Alright, I am done. Ooh, it's blurry. Okay, so I am done thrifting. I just found out that they have 50% off today. And not only do they have 50% off today, but they have 50% off every weekend. So this is a way better deal. It's a way better deal than the thrift store I normally go to. So I will be back here next Friday. Goes without saying. <laughs> Happy noon, perps. We just got some food. This is the empanada. This tiny thing. We just got some food from El Balcon. It's my Cuban sandwich and french fries and my little empanada. What was that? Is all the groceries? No, they're probably bringing up more. Yes, yeah. Show us your food. Hurry up, come show your food, come show your food. We're so hungry. It's 1.30 in the afternoon and we haven't eaten yet. So, that's where we're about to eat because today we both got a day off on Saturday. We usually don't both get days off on Saturday. So, are you going to show your food? Show your food. Stop yelling at me. I'm never yelling at you. Oops. <laughs> It's like pork and rice. We got eggs. And I think That's this is fried like a eggs. Tortilla covered in cheese. 
a tortilla covered in cheese. I usually go for breakfast. That's the funny thing, because I usually go for breakfast and you usually go for anything else, but. Settle down. Not that I'm calling you picky or anything. <laughs> but so hungry, so excited. We're going to enjoy our Saturday. Yay. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> the people that they're showing me, there's people that aren't even my same race. They're like 12 girls that weren't even my, my race. There were two guys on the list. It's just craziness. Look at 